going on everybody? I'm Cali, I'm a dad, and this is Cal Dad Taste Test, and uh, it's the day after Christmas. I hope everyone had a good Christmas. I got a new bottle cap map, that will probably be in the intro by the time you see this. The new one is a hop, and like, has way more holes than, than uh, the other maps, so I'm, I'm kind of rearranging stuff, making sure it's only beer on the hop map. I have a lot more soda caps than I thought I would. Today we're drinking uh, C4, we're trying all the Starburst flavors. I've, I've never had C4 Energy before. I think it falls into that pre-workout chalky, th those kind of drinks that are supplements as opposed to like, you know, just pure caffeine, which is all I'm looking for, really. I had a lot of caffeine on Christmas, man. I was cooking a lot. I think I had four energy drinks the first half of Christmas day. So I just kind of felt miserable. I just had a headache instead of like being wired. I think I'm numb to caffeine now. That's why I'm gonna drink three energy drinks right now at four, four in the afternoon. All right, the last candy flavored energy drink we tried was that, uh, it was the Warhead and Sour Power flavor ones. We're gonna start with the orange. Again, it, these things that say zero sugar, they're only saying this because they have sucralose in it and not sugar, but sucralose is just sugar. I was looking at the ingredients and this it says caffeine anhydrous, which is the first time I've seen that. Powdered caffeine from the seeds of coffee. I wonder if you can buy that. That's dangerous. No, 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 don't, <laughs> don't, don't. I like my caffeine to have at least some modicum of flavor. I'm not just gonna sit here and snort caffeine. And <laughs> ah, it's tart. The orange flavor is really orange. It like tastes like orange orange and not candy orange. Like this only vaguely tastes like Starburst orange. It tastes like if you added Starburst orange to like a Sprite or something. It doesn't taste bad, honestly. I like the sourness of it. Uh, it's like a like a seven. I'll give it a seven. I don't think there's any Starburst flavors I don't like. Uh, Starburst does not that many flavors, to be honest. I thought there'd be more Starburst flavors, considering how many flavors of everything else there is. Up next, we got strawberry. We got it's the pink. It's the pink one. Ugh. There you go. Oh, man, all these like the flavor is very powerful. Like it's way more intense than the actual candy. Like they poured too much of this flavor in these or something. I don't really like that one that much. It's like a weird strawberry. It's not a like, they tried to approximate the strawberry flavor of Starburst, which is also a knockoff of like proper strawberry flavor, which is not as close to real strawberry as you'd want. It's like, <laughs> like a copy of a copy of a copy. You know, it starts fading the more you do it. It's like a five. I don't, I don't like that one. This one's been especially rambly. All right, we got one more. I think this might be my favorite Starburst flavor. Uh, it's cherry. I like a cherry. See, they sell the bags of like just the pink flavor, just the red flavor now, but that's not what makes these special. Oof. They're the standout of the pack. Like, the other flavors are good, but then you have the really good one, and you either save those for last, set them aside, or you, like, you know, treasure them as part of the whole. It's like how Triple Triad, uh, the Final Fantasy VIII card game, uh, it's a great game, great little mini game, but I tried playing it outside of Final Fantasy VIII and it wasn't, it, it just didn't feel right. The whole, the whole part of going around the world and collecting cards and fighting people in this RPG, that's what makes that game special. Dorkiest analogy of 2021. Let's get it out there. <laughs> that's tart cherry. Cherry's supposed to be tart. Cherry is supposed to be tart. That hits you real good. But they, they got the flavor spot on on this one compared to the other two. That's a good cherry. That's a good cherry. I like that one. I think I might mix this with the orange, honestly. <laughs> I'll give this like a 7.5. I'm not like blown away by it, but I think it compared to the other two is pretty good. You know what? That didn't taste chalky. I was expecting that to be chalky. It wasn't chalky. I think maybe I had a C4. I've had C4 once long ago and I was just like, oh, this tastes weird. Maybe it was just that flavor I didn't like. Hey, it's Future Cali here, don't mind me. I just didn't realize there was another flavor of the Starburst C4. We got a lemon. <laughs> Whenever it wants to focus, there you go. That 
That one's pretty spot on. That one tastes exactly like the Starburst thing. It's like exactly that fake lemon taste. <laughs> I really like that one. No, I think I like it about as much as the cherry one. Whichever score I gave that, I don't remember, but I, I like this a lot. Anyway, I'm gonna finish a couple of these, add some videos, and get some stuff done. Hit me up on Twitter at Cali.Taste and Instagram at Cali.Taste, and I hope 2022 is a better year than 2021.